Hey everyone, I'm George and welcome back to the Anime Grove and today it's time for Ruby Volume 6 Chapters 6 and 7 Reaction and I'm really mad because um, it never rains here in the Canary Islands and today uh, all of a sudden I get to record, I, cl uh, I close the door, I get into my room, I start recording, I finish, all, of, all good, everything's fine, I go out of my room it has been raining while it was recording, but once I stopped recording, it stopped raining. So it's not raining now, but now I'm sure once I stop recording, I will see it rained again while I was recording again. So kind of pissed off right now, but who cares, right? Anyways, for those of you who were curious, um, I went to Italy and we stayed near Venice because this isn't a market substitute. So grab your little copy and watch it along with me. This is Rooster Teeth and there's a Ruby character hidden somewhere along the, along the video. So if you've spot them, please let me know in the comment section below. Now, if you enjoy my content, remember to leave a like, leave a comment and subscribe to join the Keepers of the Grove and help me continue growing the channel. Now, without any further ado, let's get into the video. What is this? And what? What the hell? Are these the Atlas soldiers? No. No, this is Genlock. This is a new show, I guess. I didn't expect a trailer at the beginning. By the way, let me know, have you been to the Canary Islands before? Maybe one of you even is from the Canary Islands? Who knows? But I'm so happy and so thankful we're finally at 300 subscribers. It's uh, such a big goal and I even got a achievement mail from uh, YouTube. So I'm really happy. I'm so thankful to you all. I never expected anyone to really care about what I say. And now seeing that 300 of you actually tune in for my videos, I, really incre I feel incredibly proud for what I do. And I've never been one to, so once again, I really, really want to thank all of you. But in any case, <laughs> I stop before I get cheesy. Man. Tyrion is unhinged. Last chapters. He seemed to be enjoying so hard to see how Emerald and company were going to get scolded. Now, Team Ruby is in such a, a complicated situation, like, I totally get how they can't trust Oscar now, or, well, Ospin, but what do you do then? Do you just let Salem take over the world and do as she pleases? I don't know. Storm's cleared up for now. We should be able to leave by morning. That's good. No. I don't have a good feeling about this place. Is it going to pan to the bottle? Especially with me around. Are you okay? <laughs> sure. It actually yeah, doesn't look sleep. bad. I'll wake you guys up just before sunrise. Like, I know that it's worrying that uh, Crow is an alcoholic and that we care about him, but all of all the things that we've seen, do, which we've seen him do, spending the night drinking, looking at the window, I mean, not dr drinking rather than sleeping is one of the most normal things in my head for alcoholics, so that's not something I would be particularly worried about. Plus, honestly, I feel like, sorry, I feel like it's more than anything going to allow Crow to be kind of modding to his modding his game. I don't know how to put it into words, but 
he's an alcoholic. So having the withdrawal symptoms that he would no doubt have if he didn't drink, especially under such stressful situations, I think would be counterproductive. So I for one think it's hide that he's kind of hitting the bottle right now. Maybe most of you won't be uh, won't agree with me, but out of all their problems they have right now, I don't think this is the biggest one. Maybe I am too lenient, it's a but the head of this household. I think it would be Apparently, worst for the crow's mindset. This to try and live on their own. So this is not Leo's house at all. Nor family. Just one of many hardships. Slowed down their farming, made everything harder. It's a shame, really. He seems like quite the ambitious fellow. Always thinking of new schemes to overcome the odds. <laughs> hey guys. Crow said we should get some sleep. We're gonna head out early tomorrow. Thank goodness. The last thing you'll catch me doing is letting some kid tell me what to do. Go to bed. <laughs> I like to see Ruby um, taking it with a smile. Maybe it's because I have trouble sleeping, but. It's impossible for me to go to sleep just because I have to, or someone tells me to. So... <laughs> it would be awful for me to be in that situation. <laughs> she sleeps with the relic on her waist. Close window. <laughs> Wait, that's an... Oh shit, that's three bottles. I that's heavy drinking, oh, not regular oh. drinking, and that's worse. That is not what I was <laughs> defending. Something is oh, weird, I'd say. Like they're all uh, what? out of their minds, somewhat. This volume is no, more mature than I expected. Well, dealing with more mature um, topics. She wants to be there for him. But maybe it's not something that someone can help. Not. There. It's not always. Can we just go back to bed? If we're all so tired, maybe we should make breakfast. You want to make it? Not really. I get, I'm sorry for stopping it again, but I feel like uh, these kind of topics are really important for me. And uh, I really feel like uh, it's important to clarify that I don't think Ruby can actually do something to help grow every time. Uh, that's a poor way to put it. Let me rephrase it. I see Ruby trying to approach Crow in order to help him, in order to be there for him so he doesn't have to turn to alcohol. But I also see Crow rejecting that help, or rather than that, just not acknowledging it, not going for it. And maybe I feel like it wouldn't help, because not everyone needs the same. And for example, when I have issues, it doesn't help me telling the other people it makes me double down on them so i don't think crow's gonna get help by talking to people or letting all this out sharing i don't know but i really uh, i don't know i have a, f a, a thing for characters that are broken inside and i feel like uh, crow is doing his best but he can't quite you guys got the bike ready? break out of it mm. Well, it's done now. So let's hook this thing up. And... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
fuck. Crow, stop touching shit. You people are That's also like... Luck, aren't you? She doesn't know. <laughs> no. I think the universe just doesn't want us getting to Atlas. It's just the flat tire. I'm sure there's a spare. It's not just that. It's everything. Storms, crashes, monsters. I'm so tired. Me too. It feels like we're always having to fight to get by. Yeah. And I'm sure Crow feels so That's responsible for that. He signed up but he can't stop. World. Not just... Do you know how hard it has to be on Crow? He really wants to save the world and he wants to help, but just by being there he's affecting them on a negative way because of his semblance. But he can't turn his back to the world anyways, back on the world anyways, because he knows the world needs someone. <laughs> so hard. Last night I... I couldn't stop thinking. Why are we even going to Atlas? Weiss, we have to. Why? Austin hid the relics behind giant doors under enormous schools. But how long would it take Salem to find a lamp in the middle of nowhere? What? The Grim Knight? We'd find it eventually, sure. But bury it or just throw it down the well, it would take years. It might not even happen in our lifetime. But we could be done with it now. What, where does Blake stand? Well, I see where she stands. I can't quite blame them because I can't really force anyone to give their lives for it. But I feel like they're being affected by someone. They all have weird eyes. They're all losing their uh, strength or willpower. Maybe it's related to someone's semblance. Oh shit! That scared the shit out of me actually. Fuck! Yeah, this is someone's semblance. Is it Mar Marias? Marias? Okay, now I don't have to fake <laughs> fake accent the Spanish words. Um, they're under some kind of spell. We can't just leave. We have to go down there. We have to get the lamp back. What was I thinking? All we have to do is Maria to blame for all of this. Check the shed for spare. I'm not leaving without the lamp. I'll go down with you. We'll go down together. Fine. Get the stupid lamp. Ask her fix a stupid tire. Where are you going? Oh, wait. Okay. Stupid. Once again, they keep on judging him, but... Even with everything he's got on his back, he's still here, doing this shit instead of turning his back away. So the current carried it away. I actually feel like if he wants to drink, let the man drink. <laughs> God damn it! You're being a pain in the ass. It's not like he goes out of his way to attack people when when he drinks. I did it. I find my solution. I found my solution. Oh, come on. Where is it? Turn off the lights and just look for the glow. Mm, okay. Not bad. I think if you close your eyes, uh, your eyes, the huntsman point. Uh, if you close your eyes and rub your uh, rub them like this, I think you can see somewhat a bit better on darkness. The huntsman pointed them out to me the other day. There. 
By the way, it's six, like volume six, I guess. I doubt it's I doubt it's B1. Oh shit! The the what? The apathy. Oh, the apathy is what's stalking them because they're all really apathetic. Oh shit! What I didn't get is that they are a kind of grim, I guess. Oh, so everyone on their beds died because they were too apathetic to even get up to eat, I guess? Shit. God damn it, they're creepy as hell. One of them didn't have the... This one. I saw it before and I was like, wait. They're not like this. <laughs> this one. Feels heavy. Run! Shit, but it's like they have powers. Do normal Grim have powers? No, they don't. Or maybe they're not Grim? Oh shit! Oh, a corpse? This is the first corpse we see. Like, that guy was different. Or maybe he had been dead for longer, but that was weird. And this is a base, a wine cellar? Damn, it's filled to the brim I can't with cream. I can't. Mariah seems to be like the one taking it An exit. the best. An exit. Do they eat them? Wait, there's also, there's again the noseless one. Is this a different type or is this the same model from before? <laughs> Maybe the one down here was an a skeleton, a skeleton because he got eaten? I don't know. Shit, that's so creepy! Wait. Is that her silver eyes? Run! What just happened? It's like she gave everyone a boost, right? There's again the noseless one. Is it actually... Um... A particular design? No. Shit! That was like a stronger scream. Someone help? Ruby. Her glasses what are special. Are it's silver. <laughs> oh, she can't see color, that's why. You have a family? Friends? What? <laughs> She knows about the silver eyes. Life is beautiful. It is precious. And it must be protected. Shit. 
I touch Allegri, life is precious and should be protected at all costs. But every life, not just human life. Damn, she evaporated them all. Is it because it was light or because it was a hair power? You know what I mean? Can they go out to the light? <laughs> and Oscar? Where's Oscar? Not yet. <laughs> okay, yeah, he was fixing this. Oh, he can't hear them. Hear them. Oh, is she gonna uh burn all of it? It's gonna explode. Oh, they can get out. They don't seem to even feel pain. Now we can leave. <laughs> Stop it! Stop! What's wrong with you? What? Okay. They're not strong or ferocious. They drain your will to go on. Bartleby's estate was hemorrhaging money towards the end. He wanted to cut costs on Huntsman protection. But in order to do that, he needed everyone calm. Always. She gets Sue away from their pack. Ike back was miserable, but got the bastard from the cellar. Oh, so he kept sealing the waterway entrance. I'll do it tomorrow and tell her the truth once these things take the edge off of everyone. I'm tired. He got them all the killed. Page proved that he did, but not before the rest of the pack followed their missing pair all the way home. My guess is they made their way beneath the estate through the water tunnels. That Bartleby sealed up the next morning. Bartleby's plan worked. No one was angry or sad or scared. No one was anything. And then no one was left. I'm tired and that was it. I'm sorry if I'm not speaking much. Wait, volume 8. I thought it was volume 6 I'm before. Ha have I they said. read 3 Don't volumes? Is Yang she though? Okay, she is. Can't quit until the lamp is safe. I'm it's glad no to hear that it's it because of the apathy. Things. I should have known. The signs were all there. But I'd never seen an entire she knows a lot. withered away like that. I suppose my mind just isn't what it used to be. And who are you, sis? How do you know so much about the grim? And in the tunnels, you knew exactly what to say to make me to make my eyes do that. How? Well, isn't it obvious, girl? I had silver eyes. Oh, she had them too? But had. What happened? How did she lose them? Hmm. Can you lose your silver eyes? Is that something you can do? Sinui and Lin. Okay, um, I think I have one more to record for this video, but I'm feeling kind of 
poorly because of my head it hurts a bit so I think I'm going to stop the recording here and tomorrow I'll continue the recording and upload it. Um, in any case, I'll start also, like, if I stop now, I can stop, I can start already editing the video so I can upload it now. And I'm back. Um, sorry, I just didn't really feel too Gucci, so I decided to take a break. But we're back here, um, also the videos are uploading as fast as they can given the copyright situation but if I do it correctly you should have them one after the other, one the next day, you know what, you know what I mean, day after the day. Man, the reason that the moon is broken, god damn it, the gods are so petty. God damn it, I... God damn it, I didn't realize the play on words there. Also, um... Yang is really mad because... Oh, sorry. Uh, Blake seems to be trying to treat her as Yang sees, sees it, like she's weak or she needs to be protected. But I don't think that's, that's the case. I feel like um, Blake now has a new outlook on life and I think... She's now there for Yang, as she would like the, uh, Yang to be there for her. And she's trying to help her, not necessarily because Yang can't, but because she's there for her. That's what I see, but I don't really know. Also, I, I guess, I get why Yang would feel that way, but it sucks. I'm so hyped that Neo is back, man. Like, let's go. But also something else that sucks heavily is how the group is completely broken now. Well, not the broke, but the the group, but their trust on Ospin. This is where uh, the spring. Well, Bernal got killed, right? Now you understand. Yeah. I've got to get the relic before it can be secured in Atlas. It's the only way that Salem. It's the only way we can accomplish our goal. <laughs> You're not the only one who wants Ruby dead. But unfortunately, Salem does not feel the same way. Hmm. I've been Does Salem want Ruby for her, her eyes? But you maybe for something related to the gods? You have no such <laughs> orders. That's a loophole, you I guess. You please. And don't you think um, Salem will be Help mad at you anyways. Atlas. Help me find her. And the rest is up to you. Most ambitious crossover since the Avengers. I butchered the meme, but you know the one I mean. Wait, I feel like the quality went down. Uh, it did. <laughs> okay. I did click those before. Hmm. Shit. Okay. Safe. Ooh. She has the... Well, her outfit resembles Maria's. Oh, that weapon though, that's similar to... Yo! The Ultra Nevermore. Those two camas, but they look like a bit like Ruby's side. Oh, is it like gravity? Oh, they're connected, right? God damn it. Who is this? And why is she so strong? Y 
Easy no diff. Was this some kind of special really old Nevermore? Okay. I was about to say she just annihilated it. Oh, she's a silver eyes too. Oh, maybe this is Maria? When she was younger? Man. I'm guessing the silver eyes must be somehow related to the Gorgons. Sick. Who is that? Who are these folks? Well, that's a fancy trick now, in it. <laughs> in it. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Ah. Uh, make fun of any accents. It's just I didn't expect it. Expect it. I don't think you realize who I am. Of course I do. Really? And you that oh, attack her anyways? Reaper. The Grim Reaper. And these are the last 60 seconds of your life. Why 60? Oh, is that maybe somehow related to her? What happened? To her semblance? Damn, I love the way the Kama or Saisi go back to her. Is she a um, chameleon too? Kind of reminds me of Ilya, of her scales. Ooh! This uh, bonus though is much stronger than I expected. Ooh! I figured she'd be... God damn it! She'd be just cannon fodder, but she cut her eyes? How is she so strong? It was a close call. I'll give you that. So I guess this is Mari Maria? You know, the only reason my master wants you dead is because of your eyes. <laughs> well, seeing as you ain't got them no more. You might be able to convince me to spare your life. This asshole. <laughs> well, oh, that's her that. game. I'll fight her to the end. <laughs> oh, come in. God damn it. But I wasn't. I went into hiding soon after. Well, what would you have done? I can't believe it. What could you do? You... You're the Grim Reaper. You were a legend. And then you disappeared. How exactly does a legend just disappear? You never used your name. Never showed your face. Lots of us thought you were just laying low. Eventually we came to accept that you were probably dead. But the stories about you... She I was sick. My weapon off of yours. <laughs> I wanted to be as good as the Grim Reaper. Is well, Crescent Rose then based on her? So you're well on your way. How can you say that? Child, a huntress is supposed to protect others to the bitter end. But after I lost my eyes, I only ever looked after myself. Even after my surgery, I was too afraid to fight. Afraid someone would find me again. Finish what the others started. Damn. You shouldn't aspire to be like me. Especially when some of you of are regrets. clearly stronger already. Stronger it's than she was? Seeing that your generation seems up to the Damn, task I didn't expect this world. them to get that recognition. I'm just sorry I didn't do more to leave it in better shape. Well... Maybe you shouldn't you do something now. feel like the entire Can't world you is your responsibility. Your you, did. you just live in it. You're not in charge of it. But uh, <gasps> on a side note, it would be awesome to have her How? train her. Hello? Ruby! Oh, thank you! I've been checking my scroll for your signal since we made it to the city. The 
city. Huh? Wait. <laughs> Vomit boy. Are they there? Reunion again? Nice. I like it when we're all together. Lots of fun interactions. Ladies and gentlemen, we have arrived in Argus. That's a nice view. What was that? Are you looking? <laughs> there she is. Cute boy Oz. Are you all okay? We were so worried. It's been kind of a crazy trip. That's an understatement. Wait, who's that lady? I'm so glad you're all safe. They've all grown so much. Hey, I promised, didn't I? Yeah, you did. It's good to see you guys. It's a lot bigger than I thought it'd be. It's actually one of the largest non-capital cities in all. New of city, Earth. new soundtrack. No way. Wait, wouldn't it be hard to settle something this big away from the main kingdom? Well, it was. Until Mantle showed up. Wow. Early settlement attempts by Mr. Kind of reminds me of well. parties. From Mantle, but I'm not quite sure. Leave the cold climate and return for goods that Solitas couldn't provide. The two nations work together to create a hybrid city. While it still falls under Mistral domain, Atlas keeps a military presence here to okay. help keep people safe and to keep trade between the two nations steady. Well, until recently. Until Atlas closed their borders, I guess. We should probably start looking for a ship. After the attack. So, where have you guys been staying? Uh. <laughs> there you are! <laughs> Who is, is this? Hey, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> and. Who is this? Family, maybe? I can't believe I'm meeting your sister. Yeah. Questions. Oh, I can give you. I saw the head and I thought maybe. What? I love telling stories about my baby brother. <laughs> <laughs> I am not a baby. That is a baby. <laughs> Literally the same bow. No difference between them. So, Saffron, you're the only Ark living here. Yep. Move the second I could. Jean and I are the only two living away from home. <laughs> I guess he just wanted to be like his big sis. I, uh, ah, you didn't deny it. <laughs> Everyone, Mom? this is my wife, Terracotta. Oh no, her wife. Nice to meet you. Hi. <laughs> Why, hello there. Wow, quite a party. You weren't kidding. Hun, could I get some help, please? Are they Saffron and Terracotta and sure it's for? Right uh, stay with you? Of course. The We're colors? The house huntsmen and huntresses. You all risk so much to keep people like us safe. It's the least we can do. Especially for such an elite That's so nice. Like yourself. Now I'm Although worried that something say, might happen to, to them. Had students helping you. Is that even legal? <laughs> uh, of course. Think of it as an extended training mission. Trust me, I was a professor. Even went to the same academy as them. And let me tell you, these kids are way better than we were at their age. Well, not better than me specifically. <laughs> but a lot of course, of he has to mention that. <sighs> Excuse me, I'll be right back. After what happened with Leo, I have trust is issues okay? now. Oh, yeah, it will be. Uh, Terra's a technician for the town's relay tower. Unfortunately, the military's radar system is also housed there. Why what is the baby so bored? Lately, and who's getting falsely blamed? <laughs> <laughs> Psst. 
head. So, what's your plan for tomorrow? But wait, that's that. Well, Come again? Fritz lately and because uh, radar system is also housed there. Guess what's been on the floor? Hello. There are issues is constantly, okay? I guess, but. Oh yeah, it will be. Uh, Terra's a technician for the town's relay tower. Unfortunately, the military's radar system is also housed there. Guess okay. what's been on the fritz lately and who's getting falsely blamed? So, what's your plan for tomorrow? Well, <clears throat> we're trying to make our way to Atlas. We'll probably start with the military base. So, we kind of already tried that and it didn't go super great. Come on, it couldn't be that bad. Are you wanted now or something? Oh shit, we didn't even get to see it. They're banned. Oh, it's over? Oh shit, I didn't realize now when going back that we were so close. God damn it. Okay. I like seeing this new city. I. The. Um, cultures that appear in Ruby are often like what well, sorry it's distracting me heavily because I want to take in the design of that character that was so strong okay so what I was saying is um, there are so many cultures in Ruby and so many different landscapes that everyone every time we arrive into a new one I get um, bewitched by its beauty I really like the landscapes and the how to put it I don't know any synonyms for landscapes right now but you know what I mean the a new city means an entire new culture generally and a lot of new people to meet and things to learn so I really really enjoy it on the other hand um we learned what happened to Maria and um, we saw the fight with that furnace I wonder, is that furnace really dead? Because it looked like they, they were, but it wasn't that uh, clear, so maybe they aren't? I don't know, but holy shit, they were strong. I'm guessing they were under uh, uh, Salem's commands. In any case, thank you so much for visiting my channel and for staying to the end of the video, and I hope to see you all on the next episode, so peace out.